Hey guys, welcome to Skinova's YouTube channel. In the last video, we showed you how to customize the design of your QR code. In case you missed it, the link is in the description box. So by now you know what a QR code is, right? Also unlike barcode, QR code can store a lot of information. You can actually store a website URL, links to images, link to video, and your location coordinates in a QR code. So guys, also barcode, the information that is stored in a barcode is permanent. That is, once created, you cannot change a barcode. But that's not the case with QR code. You can actually store different content at different times. You can choose what content you want to show to your audience at different times. Such kind of QR codes are known as dynamic QR codes. Also, you know that there are two categories of QR codes. The dynamic QR codes that we just talked about and the static QR codes. The static QR codes are the regular QR codes. They are the most simple form of QR code. In that as well, the information that is stored is permanent and cannot be changed. So guys, there's not much to learn about static QR code. So in this video, we'll take a dynamic QR code and how to work. So let's talk about dynamic QR codes now. If you are a serious marketer, you need to know why you should be using dynamic QR codes. So in dynamic QR code, you can not only control the content of the QR code, but you can also track how well your campaign works. So guys, now let's talk about the uses of dynamic QR codes. So number one, dynamic QR codes allow you to edit the content. For example, if you have created a static or regular QR code, the QR code will always point to the website that you have specified. But that's not the case with dynamic QR code. In dynamic QR code, you can update the information anytime you want. That is, for example, if you have a QR code on a product label that directs to a web page that shows some information. Now, you want to direct it to a new web page that shows some additional information. So, you can do it only through dynamic QR codes. Number two, dynamic QR codes make it possible to track the number of scans you're getting. You get scans by date, by region, by district, and by device, all of the information. And guys, if you choose the right QR code generator tool, you can also get information on the exact GPS coordinates. That is how amazing dynamic QR codes are. That can never be possible with static QR codes. Number three, dynamic QR codes have a higher scannability than regular static QR codes. Now, this is because the more content you add in a static QR code, the denser it is. So dynamic QR codes, they're generally cleaner and easier to be scanned. But guys, keep a note that dynamic QR codes only work with web content. That is, your mobile should be connected to a Wi-Fi network or mobile data. But if the mobile data or the Wi-Fi is strong, then it shouldn't be a major issue. So by now you know why you should go for dynamic QR code. In the next section, we will show you how to create one. So the first step is to look for an online QR code generator tool. So guys, what do you do? You Google and you'll be shown a list of results. But obviously you won't click on every link and then decide what suits your purpose best, right? Don't worry marketers, we have made your work easier. We have a video in which we have compared the top most QR code generator tools. The link is in the description box. For this video, we have used Kendova for demo purposes. For this, you need to sign up for a free trial account and then create your QR codes. So now you need to go on Kenova's website. The link is in the description box. Once you land on Scanova's website, click on products and go for QR code generator. Here, you'll have to sign up for a free trial. So in this, enter your first name, your email ID and generate a password and create your account. So here, once you land on the QR code generator page, you can create various QR codes, for example, website URL, Google Maps, PDF, wedding, etc. In this video, I'll go for website URL QR code. In this, you need to add your website web page address that you want to add. This can be any address. Once you add it, click on create QR code. Now you'll see a window. In this window, you need to name your QR code. Change the name to the QR code you want to keep. So here you will also see the option to make your QR code either static or dynamic. Click on dynamic because in this video we are discussing about dynamic QR codes. 
Now click on save. You land on a page where you'll see three QR code options. The standard black and white QR code. The second one is custom logo design. And the third one is custom background design. In this video, we'll select the standard QR code to tell you the uses of dynamic QR codes. Now the next step is, since the QR code is ready, you need to click on download. You'll see a window telling you to specify the image format as well as the custom size of the image. You can click on the format and the size that suits your purpose best and then export. Your QR code is downloaded. Say, after six months, you want to change the link that you encoded. So, what do you do now? Go to Scanova's dashboard and click on Save QR Codes. Here, select the QR code or the campaign folder. Now you'll see the QR code you just created. Click on that QR code. You'll see the web address that you added six months ago. Here, you can change or update your web address. Now, click on Update QR Code. That's it guys, your QR code has been updated. You will see that it has the same pattern as before. Also guys, you can check how well your campaign works. For this, you need to go on Scanova's dashboard and click on Analytics. Here, you will see different parameters. For example, total visits, export analytics, visits by campaign, visits by QR code, etc. So in this video, we showed you how helpful your dynamic QR codes can be. In case you have any queries, write in the comment box. We'll be happy to help you. And if you liked the video and found it useful, do not forget to click on the like button and subscribe to Scanova's YouTube channel.